The United States of America presidential polls are held every four years on the first Tuesday in November. They have what is called a fixed date election. That's not the case here in Grenada, where voters go to the polls every five years at a date selected by the incumbent party. Because you don't know when I ring the bell. I have a bell right in my pocket. You never know. <laughs> I heard you said change is coming. Change is really coming, leader of the opposition. That was Prime Minister Dr. Keith Mitchell speaking in Parliament during the 2022 budget debate as he stepped away from matters of finance to address politics. His announcement has long been a source of concern for opposition party representatives who have clamored for a fixed date as applies in the U.S. The National Democratic Congress political leader, Deacon Mitchell, says any ruling administration having the power to call general elections when they determine should be a thing of the past. The system where someone can say I have a bell in my pocket and I can ring it at any time is outdated. Uh, frankly, it's counterproductive to democracy. And it doesn't need to good governance because it essentially means you're exploiting the system for political advantage. Uh, so as a nation, we need to talk about issues such as having a fixed date for election so that the date is known in advance, everybody knows it, and that all political organizations and persons who want to take part in the political process can walk backwards from that date rather than being in a position where the party in power um, always has the advantage of choosing to call elections, the date for elections, at its convenience. Mm. One set of people aren't entitled to govern the country. Uh, we need to ensure that we create a culture within our political system that says, as I've said, you serve and then you move on so that other citizens can serve. Uh, you can't hold offices and take them to your grave. Right? We, we don't operate a, a system of a, of, a, of a monarchy. The NDC's Mitchell says despite being at a disadvantage, he is confident that his party can win the upcoming general election, which is constitutionally due in 2023. However, he said the ultimate decision lies with Grenadians. Um, so, so snap or, or long, as I said, um, we are confident that we can win the election, not because uh, we say so, uh, because we think ultimately it's the citizens of the country who will make that determination. Um, the citizens elect the MPs and have the right to remove them if they are dissatisfied with their performance. So let me make this clear. Elections are not about the opposition. Elections are about the citizens of a country making uh, and giving their opinion as to whether or not they're satisfied with the governance of the country. So an election is really on the referendum, will be a referendum, and the election, when it's called, will be a referendum on the governance of the new national party and whether the citizens of Grenada, having given it um, a unanimous, overwhelming mandate of 15-0 twice, um, back to back, whether the citizens are happy with what they've received, having given it, given them that mandate. Dickon Mitchell was speaking on GBN's To The Point program on Tuesday. For GBN News, I am Rena Pear Thomas reporting.